dark and gloomy background, but ironically the day I wanted to film the colors of the rainbow tag, it decided to pour and it's been pouring all day, so I'm sorry if the lighting's kind of messed up. The reason why I'm filming this tag today is because literally I am waiting on a rainbow to come after this storm. So Talk Backy Talk created this tag and the whole purpose of the tag is to show products that are in the packaging of the colors of the rainbow. So I'm showing you a product that is in a red packaging, orange, yellow, pink, purple, you guys know the rainbow, hopefully. Um, although my colors, I'm not really sure if I have all the colors that are in this tag, I kind of mixed them around a little bit as to how I would draw a rainbow if I was coloring it or something. So I guess I will begin and start off with red. This is the Kate Moss lipstick and this is from Rimmel London. I absolutely love the Kate Moss line. It is in 110. The color is just an absolutely beautiful like watermelon cherry color. It kind of looks like the color on my nails. And I just absolutely love this color. It is perfect for people with blue eyes. It just really accentuates them and makes them pop. And I also really, really love the smell of it. It smells like a watermelon Jolly Rancher, something amazing like that. So that is the swatch of it. And I actually have it on my lips right now. I muted it down a little bit with a soft pink. You can do so many things with this color. You can make it more vibrant or you can tone it down. So I absolutely love this. After red comes pink. And the pink product I want to show you is this Maybelline 24 hour color tattoo and this is an inked in pink. I absolutely love this color. It is a perfect base as well as an eyeshadow and it is just so creamy on the lid. I am using it today as a base. This eyeshadow base really reminds me of the Urban Decay Naked palette. It, I think it's the color is toasted. It also really looks like a mixture of sin as well so I really like this color and that is my pink product. The color tattoos last absolutely forever. They are a little harder to take off um, because it is a 24 hour long lasting eyeshadow, but they, honestly, they are amazing. As for orange, I am showing you the Yes to Carrots. This is the moisturizing eye cream. I got this from TJ Maxx for $4.99 and I absolutely love it. Um, the whole purpose of this is to help restore elasticity to those gorgeous eyes of yours, and it definitely does that. As soon as I put the product on, I can tell that my eye is firming a little bit and it just, it feels like a natural tug, so I can really tell that it's just making my eyes feel more awake in the morning and really improving the texture of them. So it's just a white milky cream, but that is my orange product. After orange comes yellow, and the product I had to show you was from The Body Shop, and this is a lemon scrub. The Body Shop has my absolute favorite scrubs ever. They just smell so good, so fresh, and they are very, very nice to exfoliate with. I use this before I self-tan, and it just gives a really nice, gentle abrasion. Um, it's not too harsh, and it is a pleasure to use in the shower. P.S. I got a Groupon. You buy $10 worth, and you get $20 worth to use at the Body Shop, so I bought two of those, and I bought four new scrubs with it. So that's a little tip. Watch out for them on Groupon, because for me, I absolutely love the Body Shop, but they do get a little pricey. I believe the next color is green. Uh, the green product I want to show you is this Queen Helene Mint Julep Mask. As you can see, it is a mint mud mask. That is the color of it. I absolutely love this. It basically sucks out all the impurities you might have in your skin, whether it's blackheads, whiteheads, or anything just gunky. If you just want to refresh your face and make it feel alive again, I highly suggest using this mask. I use it about uh, once or twice a week and it honestly helps so much. This is technically teal. I don't know if you guys would consider this blue or teal, but this is the Healthy Sexy Hair Soy Tri Wheat Leave-In Conditioner. I use this absolutely every day and I got this from Marshalls for $9.99. It just is such a nice leave-in conditioner. I spray it all throughout my hair and then comb it with a wide tooth comb. It leaves my hair soft and natural and shiny and it just really restores the hair. It's not just like a temporary product that it will make your hair feel like crap the next day. For purple, you guys have seen this time and time again in my videos. This is the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle uh, Leave-In Conditioner as well. I use this as a deep treatment. I use it as an everyday conditioner. Anytime I wash my hair, which is about three times a week, three to four times a week, I use this. So it is okay to use every day and it just really restores. Like I said, it improves the texture of your hair. That's what most of these products do. I don't like temporary products. I like products that over time with using them, they will improve just your overall condition of 
what you are trying to improve. It just absolutely makes your hair feel so soft and it is so much better than the macadamia oil uh, conditioner that everyone raves about. If you guys have not seen the good and the bad and the ugly on deep conditioners, I will link that down below so you can check it out. But you guys will be seeing this in many videos to come. The last product is supposed to be multicolored and this is the Milani Jewel FX. This is in gem. You guys have seen me wear this polish several, several times. It's just absolutely beautiful and it has little crystals. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag. It was very fun to do. It was a little hard as well. And I tag everyone who watches it, leave it as a video response, and I would love to see what you come up with. I will talk to you guys later. Mwah.